You'll never look at ginger the same way again after hearing this. For centuries, ginger has been touted as a superfood with incredible health benefits. But what if we told you that this unassuming root could be secretly harming your body in surprising ways? In this eye-opening video, we'll uncover five shocking reasons why you should think twice before reaching for that ginger supplement or adding it to your smoothie. Trust me, some of these will leave you astounded. Ginger has a rich history, dating back thousands of years to ancient civilizations in Asia. The pungent root was revered for its medicinal properties and used to treat a wide range of ailments from nausea to inflammation. Over time, it spread around the world and became a staple in many kitchens and herbal remedies. However, as modern research delves deeper into ginger's effects on the body, a more complicated picture is emerging. While ginger does have some beneficial compounds, it also contains substances that may pose risks, especially when consumed in high amounts or by certain individuals. Reason number one, blood thinning. One of the primary concerns with ginger is its ability to thin the blood. Studies have shown that the active compounds in ginger, such as gingerol and shogale, can inhibit platelet aggregation and interfere with the blood clotting process. A 2012 study published in the journal Thrombosis Research found that consuming just 2 grams of fresh ginger per day for 7 days was enough to significantly reduce platelet aggregation in healthy adults. This effect can be problematic for individuals taking blood-thinning medications, as it can increase the risk of excessive bleeding and hemorrhage. The blood-thinning properties of ginger are particularly concerning for those preparing for surgery or with existing bleeding disorders, such as hemophilia or thrombocytopenia. Even without medication interactions, the anticoagulant effects of ginger can make it more difficult for the body to form necessary blood clots, leading to prolonged bleeding and potentially life-threatening complications. It's important to note that the degree of blood thinning can vary depending on the dose and form of ginger consumed. Powdered ginger supplements, for example, may have a more potent effect than fresh ginger root. Individuals at risk of bleeding or with a history of cardiovascular issues should exercise caution and consult with their healthcare provider before adding ginger to their diet or supplement regimen. Reason number two, gastrointestinal issues. Ginger is known to stimulate digestive processes, but this can also lead to unwanted side effects, particularly for those with sensitive stomachs or pre-existing gastrointestinal conditions. Consuming large amounts of ginger has been linked to a range of gastrointestinal problems, including heartburn, acid reflux, indigestion, and diarrhea. This is due to the pungent compounds in ginger, such as gingerol and shigal, which can irritate the delicate lining of the esophagus and stomach. A 2020 review published in the journal Nutrients examined the existing research on ginger and its effects on the digestive system. The review found that while ginger may have some benefits, such as reducing nausea and vomiting, it can also trigger adverse gastrointestinal symptoms in certain individuals. The review also noted that the severity of these side effects appears to be dose-dependent, with higher amounts of ginger consumption being more likely to cause discomfort. This is especially concerning for those with pre-existing conditions like gastroesophageal reflux disease, peptic ulcers, or irritable bowel syndrome, as ginger may exacerbate their symptoms. It's important to be mindful of your body's reaction to ginger and to monitor any gastrointestinal discomfort that may arise, especially when consuming ginger in supplement form or as a concentrated extract. If you experience persistent or worsening digestive issues, it's best to discontinue use and consult with a healthcare professional. Liking our video so far? Before we move on to the next reason, don't forget hit the like button and subscribe to our channel so you never miss out on our new informative videos. Reason number three, allergic reactions. While ginger is generally well tolerated, some people may be allergic to it. Symptoms of a ginger allergy can include skin rashes, hives, and even difficulty breathing. A 2017 case report published in the Journal of Allergy and Clinical Immunology documented the case of a 45-year-old woman who experienced anaphylaxis, a severe and potentially life-threatening allergic reaction, after consuming ginger-containing food. A 2019 study in the journal Allergy, Asthma, and Clinical Immunology found that ginger can trigger contact dermatitis, a type of skin inflammation, in some individuals. The study reported that the prevalence of ginger allergy may be underestimated, as many people may not make the connection between their skin irritation and ginger consumption. It's crucial for those with known allergies to ginger or related plants, such as turmeric, to exercise caution when incorporating ginger into their diet or using ginger-containing products. If you experience any signs of an allergic reaction, such as rash, hives, or difficulty breathing, 
After consuming ginger, it's important to discontinue use and seek medical attention immediately. Reason number four, interactions with medications. Ginger can interact with a variety of medications, including blood thinners, diabetes drugs, and NSAIDs. These interactions can potentially alter the effectiveness of the medications or increase the risk of side effects. One of the primary concerns with ginger's medication interactions is its impact on blood thinning medications, such as warfarin, aspirin, and heparin. As discussed earlier, ginger has inherent blood thinning properties due to its active compounds, like gingerol. When consumed alongside blood thinners, the combined effect can significantly increase the risk of excessive bleeding and hemorrhage. A 2011 review published in the Journal of Ginseng Research highlighted the potential interactions between ginger and anti-diabetic medications. The review found that ginger may have the ability to lower blood sugar levels, which can potentially lead to hypoglycemia, low blood sugar, when taken with diabetes drugs. This is particularly concerning for individuals with diabetes who are closely managing their condition. Additionally, ginger may interact with non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drugs such as ibuprofen and naproxen. A 2016 study in the journal Drug and Metabolite Interactions suggested that ginger may inhibit the metabolism of certain NSAIDs, leading to increased concentrations in the body and a heightened risk of side effects, including gastrointestinal issues and cardiovascular problems. It's crucial for individuals taking any prescription or over-the-counter medications to consult with a healthcare provider before incorporating ginger into their routine. The potential interactions can be complex and may vary depending on the specific medications, dosages, and individual health factors. Reason number five, increased bleeding risk. In addition to ginger's blood thinning properties, it may also increase the risk of excessive bleeding, even in those not taking blood thinning medications. The active compounds in ginger can impair the body's ability to properly clot blood, which can be problematic for those with underlying bleeding disorders or who are preparing for surgery. A 2019 review published in the Journal of Ethnopharmacology examined the effects of ginger on platelet function and coagulation. The researchers found that ginger can inhibit platelet aggregation and prolong bleeding time, even at relatively low doses. This is particularly concerning for individuals with conditions like hemophilia, von Willebrand disease, or thrombocytopenia, as they may be at an increased risk of uncontrolled bleeding and hemorrhage. Moreover, the increased bleeding risk associated with ginger consumption can be especially problematic for those undergoing surgical procedures. Ginger's ability to impair clotting can lead to excessive bleeding during and after surgery, potentially increasing the risk of complications and delaying the healing process. A 2016 study in the journal Phytotherapy Research highlighted the case of a patient who experienced prolonged bleeding after a dental procedure due to regular ginger consumption. This underscores the importance of informing healthcare providers about any ginger use, especially when preparing for a surgical intervention. As you can see, ginger is not the harmless superfood it's often portrayed to be. While it may have numerous benefits, the potential risks should not be overlooked, especially for those with certain health conditions or taking specific medications. It's important to note that the risks associated with ginger consumption are often dose-dependent. While moderate amounts of ginger are generally considered safe, higher doses can increase the likelihood of experiencing adverse effects. The recommended daily intake of ginger is typically around 1 to 4 grams per day, which can be obtained from culinary use or through ginger supplements. However, it's crucial to be mindful of your individual response and any underlying health conditions or medications you may be taking. For those with specific concerns, such as increased bleeding risk or hormonal issues, the recommended dosage may be even lower. It's always best to consult with a healthcare professional before incorporating ginger into your routine, especially if you plan to consume it in supplement form or in larger quantities. Before you reach for that ginger supplement or add it to your next smoothie, we encourage you to carefully consider the information presented in this video. And if you have any personal experiences or insights to share about ginger, We'd love to hear from you in the comments below. Don't forget to check out our other video on the surprising health benefits of ginger to get a more balanced understanding of this complex root. Your health is too important to ignore, so let's dive deeper together.